of our eligible players. Steve's second stint as offensive coordinator for Alabama after being with the Atlanta Falcons. Tied up below in trouble. Down he goes. Javon Kinlaw. I said they were good in the middle to try to pressure the middle, and he just got home. Boy, if they could pick a guy that they would want to have a game, it's Kinlaw inside. Not giving a big play opportunity for South Carolina's D. Quarterback run, and he's got nowhere to go. Javon Kinlaw eventually throws down Sam Howell, and he got some help from Kingsley and Igbari. Little shoulder fake, nowhere to go, and Chambers quickly dropped to the turf. Javon Kinlaw with the opening sack of the game, the big fella. Brian in trouble, sacked. Multiple white jerseys in on the play. Three man rush. Cogonaro has time, goes short over the middle, but he gets it to Najee Harris, who only has two touchdowns today. He got it to the 20, maybe the 19, well short of the first down. Thomas has plenty of time. He'll try to take off, and he's devoured. Javon Kinlaw and Sherrod Green got to him third and long. Something special. And those came on back-to-back -back plays. Mine gets taken down again. Another sack for South Carolina. It's Enik Bari again. Had some help with Javon Kinlaw. One timeout left for Georgia. Four-man rush. Brom steps up in the pocket, it collapses, and down he goes. And I'm almost surprised that Kirby Smart called the timeout. The helmet came off of Jake Fromm, which means he's going to have to come off the field for a play. Ryan hands off again, and again, it's bottled up right near the line. So good defense by that front for the Gamecocks and it'll set up a third down. We'll call it five.